I found a $2.6 billion whale wallet. And they now only have $1 billion in this whale wallet. Where did the other $1.6 billion go? We're gonna try to put our super sleuth Sherlock Holmes hat on even though he's still a cowboy, and explore this today. If you're new to this channel, my name is Aaron. I'm on a journey to two Bitcoin while just helping as many people to their first. I am not your financial advisor. I'm just a cowboy with a lizard brain, gorilla arms, and diamond hands exploring the wild west of cryptocurrency. If you want to join me and a whole bunch of other cowboys, hit the subscribe button down below. And you know what? Join the cowboysofcrypto.com. We would love to have you. It's totally free. Lots of exclusive content on there. Check it out. There's a there's a $21 billion whale wallet that's exclusive um, that I made a video on there. So just go ahead and check it out. Sign up today. Anyway, uh, I believe that we could learn a lot from just watching whales, right? Just watching these crypto billionaires and the, the tokens they hold, the, the, the coins they hold, and what exactly they're doing. And there's a lot of that blockchain can t technology can uh, give us. And so here it is. You should know that when I found this a month ago, it was $2.6 billion. I don't think, I don't think whales just lose $1.6 billion, right? I think whales are smart, especially billionaires. I think they're smarter than you. I think they're smarter than me. Unless you have $3 billion in your account, I, you know, that's just, that's my opinion. I don't know. I just lizard brain, right? I just copy, I just copy the whales, right? And so here is their holdings. They are holding um, a lot in SRM. I don't know what that is. They're holding uh, a ton in ETH and USDT and, and LINK. We just had that uh, before, but you should know USDT and um, USDC and DAI and GUSD are all stable coins. We've been covering these whales for a while, and this is the first whale I've seen that is in to stable coins right now, which makes me think, in, in light of the current market, is all the whales getting into stable coins right now because they think the market's gonna plunge even deeper? This whale, I think, thinks so. I'm, I'm not too sure, and we gotta find out what SRM is, trading at $7.07 .07 apparently. Um, and so Project Serum, is uh, faster, cheaper, and more powerful. This guy's into DeFi. Love it. Love DeFi. And if you didn't know, DeFi is you know just a decentralized finance, and it's just a way to. And this is not going to go into any of this, right? This is just a uh, Dex. But if you, oh, it's on, it's on Solana. Oh yeah, this is Serum. I, I know this. I covered this. <laughs> I cover a lot of things. But yeah, it's a. It looks like he's backing up Solana a lot. Wow. Okay. Interesting. And so he loves. The DeFi space, he thinks, and he loves the Solana space. He thinks that Solana is going to explode. So, if you are into Solana, you should know that. Hey, you, you should be getting into Serum. I should have freaking no. I, I, I radium and Serum. He's probably into radium too a little later. Um, and so the next thing he's holding ETH. Uh, like I said, this is just fascinating. I I love Link, right? If you watched the video yesterday, you know that you know Link. I'm really big onto Link right now, especially at a good price. Uh, so it's an it's the leading oracle, the only really leading oracle in the industry right now. So anyone who needs one is going to use Link. It's just one, two, three, four stable coins, and then FTT. I'm not sure what FTT was. Uh, trade anywhere, anytime. I guess it's some kind of exchange that he 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 likes i guess it's a centralized exchange so that you, you know um, you know it, it's it's fine you got markets you got nfts on here not too sure you should probably check it out he's got a big holding or he he or she has a big holding in ftt uh gusd is the gemini dollar it's the one one us back stable coin so they're keeping a reserve of usdt and then of course they're using dai and dai is not a one-to-one -one backed it's not that it's the unbiased currency it's actually interesting because when i see people with dai here's what i know okay that they went into maker they went into maker and they put up you know dollars like they put up their own capital let's say ethereum and then they withdrew and they loaned against that why would they do that? Well, they could ex you know, increase their exposure to that crypto, or they could just hold it right now, right? So they're they're holding crypto, they're holding Dai right now to to probably buy a dip, which is very very interesting. Um, and they of course they use Aave, but still the question remains: What happened with 1.6? Did they lose it in the crash? Did they you know what exactly happened? And that's very possible, right? Everyone got wrecked in the crash. Maybe he just it was just an oversight. But what we can find out is that the best thing about crypto is that there's blockchain technology. It, it shows everyone every transaction you want. So what you do is go to this and you just copy this. You head over to Etherscan and put it in the um, in the search bar here. When you're in the search bar, 
all you have to do is look at the transactions and I could see, oh, okay, okay. So an hour and a half ago, there, he's been making trades here, she's been making trades here. And look at this, oh my goodness, you got 900 ether being moved around to this wallet. Zero, so this wallet is uh, 0 0.054, right? We've got this wallet right here, uh, 0.548. So that's 0.548 and then it's moving 900 ether to this to this wallet here okay so here we go into the transaction and so we could see that 0548 we see right here right 0548 moving you know 900 ether to this wallet well it's blockchain baby so we click on that one and now we're seeing okay so he just this person just moved 141 million dollars worth of ether like in one shot <laughs> this is incredible and oh they're trading right now two minutes ago three minutes ago this person's trading right now <gasps> look what this person's doing they're moving that ether 150 ether to this to this wallet and they moved 500 ether to a different wallet <gasps> this person is oh they feel like they're watching <laughs> i feel like they're watching me i feel like they are watching me yo and look, a 300 ether to another wallet. What is he doing? What is what in entirely? Do you see this? Yo. Okay, more chain link. That's great. Okay, so let's just do this. Let's just explore, right? Let's take this transaction. 11 minutes ago, at the time of this recording, if I'm alive, guys, you know, like say say goodbye to my wife and daughter for me. Uh, so they moved from. Okay, remember they moved it from our original 0554 wallet. They moved 900 ether to this wallet, C3, C333. Now they're moving 500 to this wallet, 0570, or 5077. So we're gonna go to this wallet, okay, this wallet. So now we're in this wallet. Uh, you know what we could do? We could take this wallet, right? And we could go into here and we could pop it in and let's see what else they have in this wallet. Oh, this is, this is some Snoopy stuff, man. I feel like Scooby-Doo. <laughs> I feel like Sco I feel like Sco I don't know why I didn't pick Sherlock. He's way cooler. But like I'm Scooby Doo. I'm solving mysteries right now. And so, <clears throat> oh, this person's trading right here. Nine minutes ago, they're operating. Okay, this is a Binance Smart Wallet. They're operating through Binance, but they swapped. <gasps> they moved. <gasps> what does this mean? What is it? So from C33. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. So they, this is the 500 ether that they got, right? This is the 500 ether that they got from C33. And now, oh five fifty seventy seven. Okay, so yeah, so we should see we should see five hundred ether in here. And there's the ether. Where's the ether? Where is the ether? Oh, it's right here. It's in the network. No. What happened to the ether? We know that there's Ethereum in this wallet. Okay, maybe Zapper doesn't tr track it. Maybe that's just not what's happening. So. We are in this wallet and we've got 500, what does this mean? I don't know, I'm sorry, I don't, I don't know where it went. They probably, did they, did they stake it somewhere? They, maybe I'm just a noob here, guys. Hit in the comment section below, what the heck just happened? Okay, so let me just track this. I moved from uh, 0548 to C33, to C333, then from C333, Look, 12 minutes ago, right? 12 minutes ago, here's the transaction. To 5077, 500 ether. I go to 577, and I put in 5077 in here. Why is it not showing 500 ether? Interesting. Guys, I'm still learning out here in crypto, but uh, if you have any recommendations or any thoughts, I don't know what happened. I feel like they were just watching because that was like nine minutes ago. I feel like they might be watching. I'm so scared. Anyways, guys, don't overthink it. Just copy the whales, right? Lizard brain, gorilla arms, diamond hands. Explore the wild west with only some trusted cowboys. Uh, join us in the uh, in the website and hit the subscribe button. That's a. I'll see you guys later. I hope.